the Gospel of John is so good. Look at this here. This is talking about the testimony of John. So this is the testimony of John the Baptist. This is the testimony of John when the Jews sent to him priests and Levites from Jerusalem to ask him, Who are you? And he confessed and did not deny, but confessed, I am not the Christ. They asked him, What then? Are you Elijah? And he said, I am not. Are you the prophet? And he answered, No. Then they said to him, Who are you? So that we may give an answer uh, to those who sent us. And what do you say about yourself? He said, I am the voice of one crying in the wilderness. Make straight the way of the Lord, as Isaiah the prophet said. Now they had been sent from the Pharisees. They asked him and said to him, Why are you baptizing if you are not the Christ, nor Elijah, nor the prophet? John answered them, saying, I baptized in, I baptize in water, but, one, but among you stands one whom you do not know. It is he who comes after me, the thong of whose sandal I am not worthy to untie. These things took place in Bethany, beyond the Jordan, where John was baptizing. The next day he saw Jesus coming to him and said, Behold, the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. Hallelujah. This is he on whom, this is he on behalf of whom I said, after me comes a man who has higher rank than I. He existed before me. Hallelujah. And we know that John, he was the old, like a, he was a, a few months older than Jesus, but it says here in John 1, 1, in the beginning was the word and the word was with God and the word was God. He was in the beginning with God. Woo, hallelujah. It's amazing. I did not recognize him, but so that he might be manifested to Israel, I came baptizing on water. See, this is one baptism, the baptism of John. He came baptizing in water. John testified, saying, I have seen a spirit descending as a dove out of heaven, and he remained upon him. I did not recognize him, but he... God, who sent me to baptize in water, said to me, He upon whom you see the Spirit descending and remaining upon him, this is the one who baptizes in the Holy Spirit. I myself have seen and have testified that this is the Son of God. Hallelujah. This right here shows you there are two baptisms. John baptized in water. For repentance. Jesus is baptizing in the Holy Spirit. Baptism in the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. And this is right here. God showed John that uh, he was going to send uh, the Holy Spirit and it will, he will, the Holy Spirit will remain upon the one who is the Son of God, who's going to be baptizing in the Holy Spirit. And then we'll go back. Let's go to Matthew. We see after being baptized, Jesus came up immediately from the water and behold, the heavens were open and he saw the Spirit of God descending as a dove and lighting on him and behold a voice out of the heaven said this is my beloved son in whom i'm well pleased so john also heard this too john was able to see that one the holy spirit was and descended he was a dove had landed on him so that was a sign of hey this is my son this is the savior of the world he takes away the sins of the world hallelujah and now we go to mark mark <laughs> the baptism of jesus well we see right here immediately coming up out of the water uh, he saw the heavens open and the spirit of this and the spirit like a dove descending upon him 
And a voice came out of the heavens, you are my beloved son, and you I am well pleased. Hallelujah. So we see that God had already previously told uh, John, John the Baptist, the son of Zacharias, uh, that see, John the Baptist, son of Zacharias in the wilderness, he already had said to him, it says, uh, now when all the people were being baptized, Jesus all was also baptized. And while he was praying, heaven was open and the Holy Spirit descended upon him in bodily form like a dove. And a, a voice came out of heaven. You are my beloved son and you I am well pleased. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for giving, giving us dreams and inward hearings of what you're saying and how you're moving and then solidifying it here in your word in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.